Okay, in this video we're going to talk about the OEE calculation, the overall equipment effectiveness. So if we click on this here, you'll see it's going to pop up a screen, and then we can enter our parameters that we want the OEE to be calculated on. So let's say you've got a 480 minute shift, and there's going to be uh, 50 minutes of breaks. And let's just say we put a note in here, so you can make any notes you want. So you might say a 30 minute lunch and uh, two times 10 minute breaks, right? And then the downtime, we may have got that from our production study. So let's say 47 minutes of downtime. And I'll just say from production study. And the ideal rate, let's say the ideal rate here in the background, we'll just do a rough eyeball here, should be about 1.03 per minute. And the total pieces produced, in this case, let's say it's 379. And the reject pieces might be 12. Once you put in your parameters, you just click on the calculate and it will calculate the OEE for that particular set of parameters right here. And it will actually show you all the formulas that are being used here. Uh, we also give you the ability to print the form. So you can click on print form. We'll just dump it right out. And you can see it's dumping out here. You can just print it directly from here. And uh, we also give you a link to a very good website that we recommend OEE information here. And this is oefoundation.org, a very good uh, source for data on this. And it actually gives you all the information about how the calculation is put together and so forth right here. So you can browse this website at your convenience as well right here. So again, very simple to do this. And obviously the data presented here is going to be preserved when you save your study.